Ready? 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 Okay. She's been taught a lot of the history. So when she plays, it's almost like she plays for the Indian people. And she plays hard. Watching Shoni, I'm just like everybody else, just wondering what she's gonna do next. <laughs> This is Shoni's, all her college material that she's opened up lately. She's actually just started getting interested in opening up. This one's from Stanford. We have like two, three boxfuls. A lot of NCAA programs are afraid to take chances with Native kids. Common thoughts are is that Native Americans don't go to college and be successful as student athletes because they long for their home. They long to be back with their people. You don't need a lot to be on the reservation. People don't judge you. It's very comforting. I see why a lot of the Indians don't come off the reservation, because there are a ton of Indians that have a lot of talent, and they just don't do anything with it. I actually am one of those that is guilty, because I had been on there all my life. care how tired you are, don't show them. Tamina. Tamina means heart. Play with your heart. If anything, play with your heart. Tamina. One, two, three. Tamina! Back when I was in high school, I was pretty good. I'm getting these letters like Shoney's getting and I know for a fact that the coach at the time said you don't want her, meaning me. And nobody even talked to me, so I didn't ever know. You talk about forgiveness. Well, my ask, my question is, how do you, how do you forgive and forget? On camera. Get in there, and wash your hands, wash your face, and brush your teeth. Mick. 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 You need to get up. Let's go. Hurry up. You have to get to school. Our kids here um, include Jude, Shay, our oldest son, Job, one of our middle boys, Saint, our youngest son, and Mick, and also Milan over on the far bleacher over there. And then obviously Shoni is around somewhere. <laughs> you can tell by our pictures that we take part in everything, still dress them up. I just miss her. I was hoping they wouldn't go. Non-Indians like to talk about um, the Holocaust, but they don't realize what happened to the Native Americans here. They wanted to annihilate all of us. I don't know if you can relate to living somewhere, a beautiful piece of country where you've been raised and they've taken you off, made you move that broke their heart, you know, to give up something they loved because they, they could really feel their land. We're awfully hurt. We're a hurt people. I have a couple family members and they in fact are alcoholics and meth addicts and they're trying to tell me that I think I'm too good, you know. And the truth of it is, is that I'm doing the best that I know how to do. Do you understand that? You hear me because I promise you I will steer you to the light. This is the first time we've, that I know of that Franklin has had kids transfer from the reservation. Okay. Okay. You all right? I love you, baby. I've seen a lot of people transfer, and a lot of them haven't worked out. Why would they go away from the ball? 
Doesn't make sense. She, she didn't go away ball. from the ball. She was standing way out she there. She was standing there thinking nobody's coming. Well, how could she not know that? Whatever, my fault. Just like being who you are and know who you are, that's really all it's about, just knowing where you come from. Last year, Franklin was four and twenty. You know, we've basically flipped that upside down, and we're we're twenty and three right now. You guys have to want this. You dig down deep, and you go hard, and you take it away from them. Ow! Just when it comes to like being Native American, you kind of have to like work harder than everybody else because you are Native American, they just think everybody like drinks and everything. So you kind of just have to like prove a point. And I really have to because I don't want to be like the other people, like the other Native Americans that did, that could have made it, but they didn't. So I kind of just have to make it. Coach, yeah. Yeah. It was my idea of well, if I want my kids to make it, you know, and and not just live on the reservation and go back. So oh, I could have done this or I could have been that. Thank you so much. Thank you. Nice to meet you. Thanks for coming. When my kids go out into the world, that's the only thing that I have for myself that rewards me that I'm doing a good job. You know that they try and be good people and. Lord knows I try, but there's every every night I'm like, God, help me to be a better person. Help me to be a better, because I don't want to be mad. I don't want to be angry. At what point do you stop and realize that, okay, I'm dealing with a whole different set of balls. I need to juggle them differently. They're heavier. Do you understand that? My mom was good. It just like makes me mad because people didn't let her do what she could. So I kind of have to do it for her, basically. Shoni said last night in the car, you can take the girl from the res, but you can't take the res out of the girl. <laughs> <laughs>